Hi, everyone. I hope you're having wonderful summer days. I hope you're enjoying activities, maybe with different people, maybe with new friends and with friends that you've known for a long time. I also hope you're finding ways to stay cool in this summer weather. We're going to talk again today about Miriam. Miriam is a person we meet in the Hebrew scriptures of the Bible in the book of Exodus. She was the sister of Moses, who is a main character in the Exodus story. He was Miriam's little brother, and she stayed with him through their lives. She was with him when they were slaves in Egypt. She was with him when he helped the Hebrew people escape. Remember when they crossed the Red Sea, the water opened up and made a path for them, and then it closed again when they were all on the other side. When that happened, Miriam, who was a prophet, she helped people learn about living in God's way when they made it to the other side of the Red Sea. She danced and sang, and she used a tambourine in praise of God and in praise of the fact that they had made it to the land, the Holy Land. They did spend quite a bit of time 40 years actually wandering around in the part of the world we now call Israel. But the joy of being away from Egypt and away from slavery is one of the things that Miriam is remembered for. Miriam's song is one that we remember when we are celebrating something wonderful in our lives. Miriam, a woman of the ancient Hebrew people. Let's pray together now. We'll fold our hands, close our eyes, and bow our heads, and we'll all say amen together at the end. Dearest God, the words of the Bible tell stories of so, so long ago stories that help us learn about your way, help us learn about the lives of people and their life in you. We are grateful for these stories that we can read them and learn from them right now in 2022. Please be with us, God. Help us to be kind and generous with the people around us. Fill us with your love that we might share only love with others. We pray in the name of Jesus, your Son, the risen Christ, and our great teacher, and we all say, Amen. Amen. Again, I hope you have wonderful summer days. We will see you next time when we again talk about a story from the Hebrew Scriptures. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.